So usually I try to make these videos fun and entertaining, but this is a very serious topic and an important one, keeping your family safe around the pool. I've been personally affected by a near drowning experience in my own family around a swimming pool, and I can tell you that it's hard to fully relax and enjoy your pool if you're worried about your family's safety. So let's talk about how pool alarms can keep everybody safe and put your mind at ease. <laughs> Quick disclaimer, the information in this video is based on my own personal experience in the pool industry and the research we've done here at swimuniversity.com. And I'm sorry if I missed anything. And if I did, please leave a comment to let me know and to help your fellow pool owners. So you remember what it's like to be a kid in the pool, right? I mean, once you were in it, you didn't want to get out and pools are irresistible. Doesn't matter how old you are. But now that you're an adult, Let's face it, you can't watch your kids every second of every day, and you can't post yourself at the pool's edge to make sure that your kids don't jump in when they're not supposed to. And if you think your kids won't try to sneak off to the pool when you're not looking, well, let's just say you're in for quite a few surprises once puberty kicks in. Trust me. So when we talk about pool safety, we have to consider some sad statistics. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention estimates that more than 700 children in the US die from drowning every year. And for every child who drowns, five more require emergency room visits for non-fatal submersion injuries. Now, this is what happened with my family. My two-year-old cousin had to be rushed to the hospital after falling into a pool floating face down. Thankfully, she was fine and uh, she just graduated from college. What's really tragic, though, is that every single one of these cases is completely preventable and that's where pool alarms come in. By the way, some states and counties and municipalities require residents with pools to install pool alarms. So before you make any purchases, please check your local authorities to make sure that you're in compliance with local laws. And then once you've decided that you need a pool alarm, you have four options to choose from. Your first option is called a threshold alarm. This is installed on windows and sliding glass doors to alert you when they've been open. So if one of your kids tries to sneak out to the pool through the patio door, an alarm will sound and you will get there before they can even get to the edge of the patio. The second type of alarm is a surface wave sensor that sounds when the pool water is disturbed. Anytime someone or something tries to get into your pool, water is displaced, which causes a ripple, and the alarm that floats in the water will actually start to create a sound. And they even have remote receivers to sound the alarm inside the house in case you're not near the pool area to hear it. The third option is a pool alarm with subsurface disturbance sensors. They're installed on the edge of the pool and have an arm that extends down into the water that will sense water movement and sound the alarm. These alarms are a great option if you'd rather install something permanent that won't be floating around your pool. And they usually have a sleep mode so that you can turn them off while you're actually in the pool. Just remember to turn it back on when you get out. The fourth type is a wearable alarm. A wearable alarm straps to your child's wrist and then locks in with a key so they can't remove it. And if the wristband gets wet, the alarm will go off to alert you. A wearable alarm is also good for pets and for loved ones who may have a tendency to wander like elderly relatives. You can get just one type of pool alarm or you can get all of them. They're pretty reasonably priced, but no matter the cost, it's a small price to pay for your family's safety and for your peace of mind. So that's it for getting pool alarms. I hope it was helpful. There's a lot to choose from out there, but you can go to our website to learn more about pool alarms. If you want to learn even more about taking care of your pool with in-depth tutorials and guides, you should check out our pool care handbook and video course. You'll get over 31 video lessons plus a fully illustrated guide covering everything you need to know about pool maintenance. And it's packed with money-saving tips so you won't break the bank while taking care of your swimming pool. And this is the ultimate manual for every type of pool and because it's the internet, it's always up to date. And because you watched this entire video and thank you so much, you can get 10% off by using the promo code video. Just go to swimuniversity.com slash pool dash care dash handbook or click the link below. And if you missed anything or you have more questions about pool alarms, please leave a comment below. Or if you wanna learn more about pool maintenance, troubleshooting, product reviews, or taking care of a hot tub, subscribe to our channel for more videos like this one. And as always, happy, safe, safe swimming. Yeah.